Hey everyone, Scott here from Simple Mechanic Advice. Today we will discuss the causes of your vehicle's radiator being hot at the top and cold at the bottom and possible fixes. It is normal for the top hose to be hot since this is where the hot coolant enters the radiator before being cooled down. If your radiator's bottom hose stays cold, it signals poor coolant circulation. Normally, hot coolant enters through the top hose, cools in the radiator, and exits through the bottom, which should still feel slightly warm. Here are the likely causes. Blocked radiator. If your vehicle's radiator gets clogged, it will restrict the free flow of coolant. With continuous driving, rust from the hose components and debris could accumulate in the radiator itself and its hoses, forming a blockage that restricts the movement of antifreeze in and out of the radiator. This will cause the input hose at the top to be hotter than the one at the bottom. Malfunctioning thermostat. The thermostat is an integral part of the vehicle's cooling system. It signals whenever the engine is too hot to allow movement of the coolant. When it malfunctions, the movement of the coolant to and from the radiator is inhibited. This uneven circulation of the antifreeze will result in the bottom part of the radiator being cold. Leaks and low coolant levels. There may be leaks at certain points of the cooling process, reducing the coolant levels. The coolant is responsible for transferring heat in the cooling system, and a lack of it may be why the top part of the radiator gets heated. In contrast, the bottom part remains cold since the heat isn't transferred. Solutions to this problem. Inspecting the coolant levels. Regularly check the coolant reservoir in your vehicle and ensure it's at the manufacturer's recommended levels for optimum cooling system performance. Regularly inspect the radiator and its components. Ensure that you visually inspect your vehicle's radiator, hoses, and entire cooling system for any leaks or tears, and make any necessary repairs should the need arise. Replacing these hoses after achieving a mileage of about 60,000 is also advisable. Replace a spoiled thermostat. When your engine's temperature gauge reads extremely high temperatures, or if the temperature erratically fluctuates, these are obvious signs that you should replace your vehicle's thermostat with a functioning one for optimal engine performance. Thanks for watching.